November the 11th, 2025. Guys, a very short video with the link, uh, and I think maybe you can uh, enjoy this and get some real-time information from it. We're looking at the real-time solar wind, and I mentioned in the videos earlier that around 4 p.m., we'd start seeing some impacts from what would be about 24 hours of increasing solar wind speed, plasma density, earthquake problems, and all of that, right? Well, it's beginning right now. It is 5.05 uh, or 5.07 p.m. Central Time, but let's go back a little bit in time right here. And this is a three-day chart, guys, going from here to here's one day, from here to here, and then today on the 11th is from here to here. So right now, again, not very far off in the timing, we're starting to see a step up. And remember, if you look, there was three different solar uh, flares coming in of coronal mass ejections. And they would start about this time, and they have. So this is not a big jump, but it is a very impactful rise. In other words, a brick ball. And now, again, think about this. It has not risen to 600 like it was three days ago. We're more, let's get right here, 511, right? But remember, it's going to rise to 1,300 kilometers per second before this is said and done and uh, create a G4 magnetic storm. Also, the shields are still open. Look at the top here. They're trying to close, but now look at how that widened the gap. I warned about that in the earlier video. So if we're getting extreme solar bombardment while our shields are open, that just amplifies everything. I'm not going to make this much longer. I'm going to put a link in the video comments below to this. And so you can watch it coming in real time. Now, what's happening is we have a couple of satellites up that this information is coming from that depending on the solar wind speed gives us 30 or 45 minutes uh, heads up. In other words, it's between us and the sun. And, and they're about a million miles out, most of them. But the sun is 93 million miles away. So this gives us a very accurate uh, assessment of solar wind speed because it has already slowed down through that period of time uh, to where we're getting, again, we talk about muzzle velocity is very fast. Over that period of time, you've got everything slows down. But here it is right there. We're starting to see the beginning of it. And the link will be below. Don't want to draw it out. It's been a long day with a lot of videos. In these times, a lot of information is coming out. So just prepare for that. And guys, uh, God bless every one of y'all. Heads up, be safe. Check the link out below.